During our pre-season we do a lot of repeating sprints and some weights. We tend to avoid going for long runs because netball is a short sharp sport and we need to be nice and explosive and quick off the mark. Before a game, make sure you have plenty of energy, but try not to eat anything new before a game, like a hot curry for example, because no one wants to have an upset stomach when they're trying to play. If you've prepared well for a match and had plenty of rest and the right nutrition, then fatigue is more of a mental battle. So, if you're feeling tired, make sure you push yourself through the end. Okay, now let's hit the court and I can demonstrate some defensive skills. Well, I hope you learned something from that. After a big game, I always like to have an ice bath because it helps the blood circulation get through your muscles and helps them repair quicker. I also like to have a nice big sleep so that I wake up feeling fresh the next day. If you're travelling for a big carnival, it's important to bring something to do to keep you occupied. Also, I like to wear compression tights or compression socks to keep my muscles fresh so that I'm ready to go as soon as I get on the court. Also, Make sure you drink heaps of water to keep you nice and hydrated. To help prevent a knee injury, make sure you do lots of exercises to strengthen your knee muscles. Also, do balance exercises to help prevent an ankle injury. If you're not sure, ask a physio or strength and conditioning coach. I hope you've learned something from watching this video today. And remember, always respect your coaches and teammates. For more information, visit the Netball Queensland website.